Alright, time to go over there. I'm not gonna leave a single one of them alive. Well, except for those two in the trailer, maybe. Maybe. I'll get my speech up. I'll see if I can convince them to help mankind. And if they do, I'll let them live. If not... Well, they'll help fertilize the earth. At least they'll help some way. Who's this? Eh, not yet. Bam! Aww. Oh, he just folded over like a rag doll. Alright, bottle cap buff out. What is that? A trail car beam, huh? What? Uh, items? Weapons? DPS 53? Damage 27, huh? Ooh. That's nice. But I need my silence. Oh, well, there are lots of people here. Quick save. Great con. Great con. Great con. Which means they're not important. <laughs> Vilified! Oh no! Dirty coward. Hang on. Let's see if there's a way to kill these people without them waking up. Ah, uh, quick save. Yes. Perhaps some sort of, uh... Throwing spear. <laughs> Hi. Okay, okay. Reload. Save, yes. If I can't uh, kill them without people knowing, then I'll go get them last. How am I detected exactly? Alright. What do you mean, zero percent chance? There we go. Did I kill it? Oh, sweet! Murderer! Oh, they heard. Yeah. Hey. All right, hang on. Let's reload. Try it one more time. No. If I kill someone with a knife, they should not wake up the other people. That's my opinion. And my opinion should be law. Law, I say. Well, that sucks. Really? You can't just walk up and slice her throat? Alright, alright, I'll take this tent out last. I need to find easier single targets. Like over here. Anyone in here? No. Hello, what's this? Alright.
Alright. Uh oh. It's becoming daylight. Nino likes that. Let's go. 15 hours? Sure. <laughs> I just hope no one comes in this tent all day and notices all their dead comrades. Oh, what was I thinking? If I waited for them to get up and start walking about, they would not all be there in the same tent, would they? Like thus. So now I can go find them on their own, perhaps. Take them out that way. Just a thought. Oh, how do I get up here? Don't need to hide right now. Oh, hey, look, Dead Con, who did that? Huh. Alright, I'll go in the house in a second. Let's see if anyone's up here. No. Guess not. Alright then. Let's go in here. Hello. Sure are a lot of you. Not now, I'm busy. Apparently. Alright. No, 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 no. Great con, great con. Regs. Papa con. Carl. I had been warned. You were perilously close to making an enemy of Caesar, and that is not wise. What do you think of the Great Cons? Now, who are you? My name is Carl. Glorious Caesar has sent me as an emissary to the Great Cons as a token of our alliance. Okay, what alliance? In exchange for Great Caesar's promise of all the lands west of New Vegas, the Cons have agreed to fight alongside the Legion when the time comes. Is that so? What is your role in Caesar's Legion? I am one of the Frumentari. It is my duty to scout the waste in Caesar's name and make contact with any tribes that might serve a useful purpose. You might say I'm somewhere between a scout and an ambassador. I'm assigned here as part of the alliance between the Legion and the Great Khans. Okay, what does the Legion want with the Great Khans? Though they have been cruelly oppressed by the NCR, the Khans remain great warriors. The Legion is honored to have such allies in battle. Alright, I had some other questions. Speak then. Uh, what do you think of the Great Khans? They're a tribe of fine warriors with many proud traditions and a glorious history. They will be worthy additions to the Legion. Goodbye. Yes, goodbye. Uh, let's talk to you. I haven't seen you before. What brings you to the Great Cons? Death, murder, mayhem, all yours. Uh, what is your opinion of the NCR? That's a complicated question. They've done horrible things to our people, to be sure. And I've gladly killed many of their soldiers in battle. But I can't bring myself to hate them the way Papa does. Things would damn sure be better for us if they were in charge than Caesar. So if you were in charge of the tribe, you'd fight with the NCR against Caesar if asked? I suppose if asked, I would. But that's a moot point, because Papa's in charge now, and he's not going anywhere. Tell me about Papa Khan. Papa is one of the best leaders the Khans have ever had. He's kept us together through all of our hardships, ever since we left California. Bitter Springs changed him, though. He started to really hate the NCR after the massacre. And sometimes, I worry that's poisoned his mind. Uh, what do you mean by, uh, about Papa's hatred poisoning his mind? Now tell me about Bitter Springs. I really don't like to talk about it. Let's just say it was a tragedy, and the NCR is to blame, and we'll leave it at that. Okay. Uh, what do you mean about poisoning his mind? Nothing. Forget about it. I shouldn't be talking about this with an outsider. Okay. Who are you? Name's Regis. I'm Papa Khan's advisor and right-hand man. I'm also the chief enforcer of the tribe's laws, so watch your behavior. Goodbye. 
Until next time. No, no, there will be no next time, sir. Hi, Papa Colin. So the cub enters the wolf's den. What do you want, cub? Uh, didn't you hear me talking to him? Death, murder, mayhem? Do I have to repeat myself to everybody? I've come to ask the Great Comms to break their alliance with Caesar's Legion. No, politics doesn't matter to McSquee. He's here to kill them all. Uh, can you tell me about your people? You want to hear the story of the Great Cons? It's a long one, full of honor, glory, and betrayal. We have suffered, but we will regain our glory. Maybe you could give me the short version? In a hurry, are you? Very well, then. The Great Cons came east, out of the NCR 14 years ago. We ruled the wastes then, and called no man master. But we underestimated the families of the Strip, and they drove us back to Bitter Springs, where we remained until the NCR arrived and drove us here. Uh, how did the three families defeat you? They allied with Mr. House, the self-proclaimed master of New Vegas. He supported them with the resources of New Vegas. Weapons, technology, caps. They were better equipped, and we could not stand against them. And what happened at Bitter Springs? When the NCR came to the Mojave, we thought they would be easy pickings. We raided their caravans, their towns, their camps. They couldn't stop us. At least that's what we thought. They tracked us to Bitter Springs and surrounded us. When our children, our sick and old, fled through a nearby pass, the NCR gunned them down. Doesn't sound like something the NCR would order. Oh, they claimed it was a miscommunication, but tell that to those who saw our families butchered. Tell it to the survivors who were banished here. On second thought, let's talk about something else. Typical. No reverence for history in the younger generations. I love history. Uh, who are you? You march all the way out to Red Rock Canyon, enter my home as bold as you please, and you have no idea who I am? You've got guts, I'll give you that. Why, thank you. Well then, let me educate you. I am the chief of the great cons. Ex-chief. The con of cons, if you like. Ex-con of cons. This is my tribe. Was your tribe. These are my people. Were your people. You are not following me, are you? Uh, let's ask just to be curious. Have you now? Hmm, well, you're a bold one, I'll give you that. But why should I do this for you? Caesar is only using you. He doesn't actually care about the great cons. Do you really think Caesar's going to restore your tribe to glory? You'll be made slaves because the NCR is the best hope for long-term stability in the region, not Caesar. No, you'll all be made slaves. Ha! The great cons will not be slaves. Caesar himself has promised us the land from here to the Colorado and the freedom to raid as we see fit. I won't hear any more talk against Caesar or his alliance. The Great Cons will answer Caesar's call to war, and the NCR will pay for their crimes. Well, even if you didn't broke your alliance with Caesar, you already admitted you'd still be raiding innocents. Farewell. Which means... I gotta set up. I gotta prepare. I can't just go into this blindly. I'll get myself killed. Alright. Let's see. Let me go test something. I heard you try to convince Papa Khan not to join with Caesar's Legion. I'd like to talk to you about that for a moment. What is it you have in mind? You want to convince Papa not to ally with Caesar, right? I want to kill you, Trust really. Me, you'll get nowhere just talking to him about it. He's fixated on restoring the glory of the Great Khans, and he sees Caesar as the path to that restoration. So what do I do? Papa can be a stubborn man, but he's not a tyrant. He listens to his tribe, and to four voices in particular. Me, Jack, Diane, and Melissa. If you can convince all of us that allying with Caesar is a bad idea, you might be able to sway him. Aren't you convinced already? If we're having this conversation? I have my doubts about Caesar, yes. But I won't publicly go against Papa Khan based on nothing more than doubts. I've heard rumors that tribes who aligned with Caesar in the past were torn apart and reduced to slaves. Prove it, and I'll back you. 